everyone! We're here at the Paw Patrol mailbox with Chase the Police Pup. But this isn't a regular mailbox. It's a magic mailbox. When someone puts a letter inside a magic mailbox, the mailman delivers an awesome surprise toy. Chase, do you have a letter that you want to mail today? Here it is! I wrote a special wish in this letter. I just hope that it comes true. Chase wrote his letter on green paper. That's right! I'm wishing for a really big green toy! That sounds awesome, Chase! But before we can put the letter in the mailbox, we have to put a stamp on the letter. Since Chase's favorite color is blue, we'll use this blue stamp with two funny fishies. Okay, Chase, your letter is ready now. We can put it into the magic mailbox. Oh boy, this is so exciting! I'll be back soon to see if my big green surprise toy gets delivered. Bye, Chase. See you soon. Hey, wait. Who's that? It's Boss Baby. And he's acting very sneaky. Give me a big thumbs up if you think Boss Baby is up to one of his evil plans. Puppies like the Paw Patrol Pups are too cute. And I need to stop them. I have a plan. The Paw Patrol think they're so smart. But guess what? I have the mailbox key. And now I'm going to use the key to open the magic mailbox and still chase his surprise toy. And it will be all mine. Ha 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 ha. He's so mean to the Paw Patrol pups. And look, there is something inside the mailbox. That means Chase's wish came true. Oh boy, I see something in there. It's a really, really big surprise toy. I can't wait to see what Chase got. Wow, it looks like a huge surprise egg. Is it a Hajimo egg? This is the coolest surprise egg I've ever seen. And it's all mine. Look, the egg is starting to hatch. Wait, this isn't a Hajimo. It's... A big green dinosaur. A dinosaur, oh no. I'm getting out of here. Good job, dinosaur. You scared the mean boss baby away. He wanted to take you home with him. And look who's back. It's Chase. Chase, the mailman delivered your mail. Wow, my own dinosaur. Just like I wished for in my letter. I asked for a big green surprise egg and this is exactly what I wanted. Hmm, I think he's a little hungry. Let me feed him the yummiest dinosaur food. A bowl of green gumballs. Chase wants to feed his new pet some green gumballs. I didn't know that dinosaurs' favorite food were gumballs. Let's see if he eats them. Okay, dinosaur, open wide. Wow, he's eating them. And they're all gone. Wow, dinosaurs really do like gumballs. Just like I do. That's why he's my new best friend. I wonder what he wants now. <coughs> wow, look. He didn't want anything. He just wanted to give Chase a surprise toy. Let's see what it is. Awesome. It's a flip a zoop line bag. I wonder what's inside. Here is a flip a zoop line bag that shows all the animal combinations we can collect. And here is our toy. It's a purple and pink hedgehog. But when we flip it, it becomes a turtle. Nice. And the turtle is green, just like the dinosaur. Don't they look a little alike? Chase is so happy. Not only did he get a new pet dinosaur, but he also got a fun flip -a zoo toy. Okay, dinosaur, you can hold on to our toy. Let's go home so we can play some more games. Follow me. Bye, Chase. Bye, dinosaur. See you soon. Okay, we're back at the Paw Patrol magic mailbox. And look, Sky the Pilot Pup is here. Hi, Sky. Are you here to learn how to use the mailbox? Yes, Chase told me he got an awesome surprise. 
surprise. So I want to try too. I wrote a letter with the one surprise I want most. I want the biggest gummy snack ever. I hope I get it. That's such a silly wish, Sky. I know you love gumballs. But remember, we have to put a stamp on the letter before we can send it. Let's put it on the mailbox. Okay, Sky. Now we just have to wait to see if the mailman makes your wish come true. Wow! I really hope it does. I'll be back soon. Bye! And I'm back. Did the mailman come? Did he? Did he? I think he did come, Sky. But I'm not sure if he delivered your gummy wish. Let's use the yellow key to open the mailbox and find out. Hmm. It looks like there is something in there. But I'm not sure what it is. It's too dark. Wow, what's this? It feels like a gummy worm. Wait, look. This isn't a gummy worm. It's a red gummy snake. A huge gummy snake. And there's more inside the mailbox. Oh, it has a blue half also. This is the biggest gummy snake ever. It's so heavy that I can barely hold it. Good job, Sky. You asked for a gummy candy. And you got the biggest candy in the world. But wait, Sky. You can't start eating it until you get home. Okay. Is there anything else inside your mailbox? Yes, there is. Nice! It's a Frozen movie pop-ups! I love the Frozen movie and all the characters like Anna, Olaf, and Kristoff! Cool! It comes with three yummy lollipops! Sky has even more sweet candy to share with her friends at school! And here is a toy! It's a Nelsa lollipop holder! When you push this button on the side, it opens up! We'll take this pink lollipop and put it inside the Elsa holder. Isn't that cool? Okay, Scott, when you're ready to lick your lollipop, you just press the button and lick away. Elsa will protect your lollipop in case the mean boss baby tries to steal it. All right, Sky, you better get home and start thinking about who you're going to share all the gummy candy with. Bye, Sky. Oh no! Look who's back! It's Boss Baby! Boss Baby tries to still chase his mailbox surprise before. What does he want now? Hmm, Boss Baby wants to try and mail his own letter this time. He saw all the awesome surprise toys that Sky and Chase got, so he wants his own. And wow, I think your mail was delivered already. Let's open up the door and see. Wow, I see something. It looks like Boss Baby's wish came true. Let's take a closer look. What's this? It's an ice cream bowl. Slime, yuck! I hate slime. The Paw Patrol beat me again. Let's see who's coming over next to make a wish at the magic mailbox. Hey, it's Chef the Mean Bergen! Bridget took so long and I'm so hungry. I really need something yummy to eat. I wish for a big bowl of the yummiest, most colorful Trolls Cheerios. Hmm, Chef wished for a bowl of Trollios. That's not a very nice wish. Press the thumbs up button if you want to see if Chef's wish came true. Wow, it looks like her wish was delivered already. There must be something inside now. Let's open the mailbox with the magic yellow key and see if your wish came true, Chef. And look, Chef got a bowl of Cheerios. Oh no, Chef is finally going to be able to eat trolls. That's not nice. My wish came true. I have my own bowl of troll cereal. Let me have a bite. Yuck. These aren't Troll Cheerios, these are regular Cheerios. They aren't colorful, and they don't taste like Trolls. Gross! Bridget got what she wished for, but I didn't. 
That's not fair. The next person to make a wish at the magic mailbox is the boss baby. Boss baby is taking a break from his business meeting and came to make a wish. Boss baby has a lot of wishes that he wants to make, but today he only make one special wish. He wishes for a troll's friend to play with today. That is a really nice wish. I hope it comes true. Uh oh! It looks like Boss Baby has to go potty. It's an emergency. He'll be right back. Hurry back to get your wish. Oh no! What's Chef doing here? It's not her turn to make a wish. Boss Baby made a wish, and it looks like Chef is up to no good. Chef didn't get the wish she wanted, so she's trying to make another wish. Hey, wait! Chef is sneaking inside the magic mailbox. She wants to steal Boss Baby's troll wish. What a sneaky villain! <laughs> Boss Baby's wish should be coming soon, and it will be all mine. But wait, how do I get out of here when I get this troll? Boss Baby came back. He made a wish for a troll friends to play with. I hope he gets his wish. Let's open the magic mailbox with the magic yellow key. Boss Baby can't wait to see what troll he got. It's Chef, and she's holding Boss Baby's troll surprise toy. She was hiding from Boss Baby and stole Boss Baby's troll friend. This is my troll now, Boss Baby. It's not nice to scare little babies. Chef finally got the wish she wanted, but she was cheating. Boss Baby is so sad that Chef is being so mean to him. Chef is finally going to get the troll she always wanted. Let's open the blind bag and see what troll we got. Hey, it's Creek. Creek is a sneaky troll, just like Chef. But Creek looks a little different here than he does in the Trolls movie. This Creek is yellow with pink troll hair. Even though he looks different, Creek is still so much fun to play with. Chef wanted to eat Creek in the Trolls movie, and now she got another chance. Watch out, Creek! Chef wants to have you for lunch. Oh no! I hope Bridget will save you. I hope the next wish for the magic mailbox is a nice wish. Hey, it's King Gristle's turn to make his wish now. He's really excited to make a wish. He's never had a real wish come true before. King Gristle is thinking about his wishes. Hmm, he wishes for a toy and a yummy treat he can share with Bridget. I hope his wish comes true. Wow, that was fast! It sounds like you got a wish inside. I just hope Chef isn't hiding inside again. Let's open the mailbox with this special yellow key. Awesome! King Gristle's wish came true. He got a pint-sized Spider-Man blind bag. Spider-Man is the coolest superhero. This pint-sized hero toy can fit in your pocket. Let's see what's inside. Wow! Look at this Spider-Man we found. This Spider-Man has really cool blue and red costume. His head is really big, but his body is so small. What a cool Spider-Man toy! I think there is another wish inside the mailbox. Let's check. Awesome! It's a bag of Chips Ahoy cookies. Yummy! This is Bridget's favorite cookies. There's enough cookies to share with Bridget later. That was so nice. They both wished for snacks for each other. Have fun with your day with Bridget tonight, King Gristle. Does anyone else want to make a wish? Hey, look! Boss Baby is back at the magic mailbox. Boss Baby wants to make another wish since the evil chef stole his first wish. Let's see what Boss Baby wants this time. His wish is for Creek to come back so that Chef doesn't eat him. That's such a nice wish. Boss Baby isn't a selfish baby at all. He could have wished for a toy, but he wished to save Creek. How nice! I think it worked. Let's open the door with the yellow key. I see something in here. It's Creek. Boss Baby's wish came true and saved Creek from the mean Bergen chef. Boss Baby is so happy. But look, it's Chef again. You better run away, Boss Baby. The Boss Baby ruined my dinner. He's so mean. But don't worry. Next time, I'll have an even better plan to cook a yummy troll. Santa did come, but what kind of present will I get? 
I'm sorry, I won't ruin Christmas anymore. <coughs> Sit, give me your paw. This is Zelly Sparkles here with Santa's mailbox. This is where all the good boys and girls drop off their letters to Santa each year at Christmas time. If they were really good, their gift will magically appear in the mailbox. But wait, what is Grinch doing here? The Grinch is dressed up as Santa and he has a key. What are you doing with the mailbox key, Grinch? Ha 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 ha, you're right. This is the key to Santa's mailbox. I'm going to wait till all the boys and girls deliver their letters to Santa's box. Then, when their Christmas gifts come, I'm going to take them. This is my best plan ever. I'm going to take everyone's Christmas gifts this year, and I'll have everything. I can't wait to see who's first. I better go before somebody gets here and catches me. Oh boy, oh boy, I can't wait. It's finally time to mail my wish list to Santa. This is the best time of the year. I've been such a good girl all year, and I want my very special doggy toy this year. I sure hope Santa gets my letter and sends me a present. Oh wait, I forgot one thing. I have to put a stamp on my envelope before I mail it to the North Pole. There we go. That should do it. We just have to drop it in the box. I sure hope Santa rates my list. I promise, I was a good pup all year long. I'll be back soon to see if my present gets delivered. She's finally gone. And I think I saw Santa bring her a present already. Oh boy, my very first Christmas gift of the year. This is gonna be so good. Here's my key. I can't wait to see what I find. Ooh, I see something. Santa did come. Well, what kind of present will I get? Oh wow, look at this. It has a big red bow on it. I wonder what it could be. What? A doggy bone? What am I gonna do with the doggy bone? I'm not a puppy. I don't want this. Of course that's what Sky wished for. She's a doggy. But I'm not a doggy and I don't want bones for Christmas. Yuck. I want awesome toys, not icky doggy toys. Sky ruined my plans. Hmm, but maybe someone else will ask for a cool toy. I guess I'll just wait here for them. I wonder who else will be sending a letter to Santa next. Oh, here comes someone now. <laughs> it's baby Jack-Jack from The Incredibles. Jack-Jack can't wait to send his Christmas list that his mommy helped him write to Santa. Hey there, Jack-Jack. Looks like you have your letter in an envelope. And it already has a stamp. That's great. Good boy. Let's put it in and send it to Santa. Were you a good boy this year, Jack Jack? Yeah. Great. Then you can come back later and see if Santa left you a special surprise. Bye bye, Jack Jack. See you soon. <laughs> He's gone. And I know Santa delivered his gift. Who knew that a silly baby was a good boy this year? Anyway, let me see. What could we have in this mailbox? I just hope it's better than a silly dog bone like Sky got. Oh, I see something. And it's really, really big. Look at that, it's huge. This must be a really great gift. It barely even fits in the mailbox. I just can't wait to see what it is. Whoa, I love this nice bow. Whenever a gift is really big, it must be really awesome. But there's only one way to know for sure. Thanks, Jack-Jack. Time to see what you got for me. Huh? What's this? A potty? Jack-Jack got a potty? A baby potty? Oh no, first a doggy bone and now a potty. I don't use a potty, I'm a grown up, not like baby Jack-Jack. I should have known that a superhero like Jack-Jack would try to ruin my plans. This is the worst Christmas ever. But wait, there's still time for other boys and girls to write Santa a letter. 
Maybe the next person will have an awesome gift for me. I better get out of here before they get here. Yay, I made it just in time. I got here before the mailbox closes. Now Santa will definitely get my letter. I've been so good this year. I got along with my sister Violet, and I babysat Jack-Jack a lot. Santa has to bring me something perfect. I'm going to ask Santa for a cute little pet. It's the only thing I want, so I hope Santa brings it for me. I'll be back soon, Santa. Please bring me what I want. I promise I'll be good next year if you do. See you later. Back again. Did you see who that was? It was Dash. And if anyone can ask for an awesome gift from Santa, it's definitely Dash. Time to see what he got. All right, here I go. Time for the final gift of the day. Hey, wait, I don't see anything in here at all. Hello, is anyone in there? Come on, it's me, Santa Grinch. Wait, I see something. What's that? Oh, that's scary. Is that a monster? Is that a, a big mean dog? Oh, I don't like scary dogs, and they don't like me. Look at that big sharp teeth he has. No, good doggy. Stay, stay. I said stay. Oh no, he's chasing me. I'm sorry, I won't ruin Christmas anymore. Ah, go away. Sit, give me your paw. Hi, Dave. Are you going to mail a letter today? <laughs> no? If he doesn't want to put a letter in the mailbox, then what is he doing here? Are you there, Dave? There he is! But wait! He's holding something! He has the key to the magic mailbox! Dave, are you going to do something silly? <laughs> He's opening the mailbox! But why? What could he be doing in the mailbox? He's going to hide inside the mailbox and take someone's mail! Give me a big thumbs up if you want to see what this silly minion does in the mailbox! And look, it's Moana! She's one of my favorite Disney princesses! Moana must be here to mail a letter to her mommy and daddy, Tui and Sina! This letter is really cool! It looks just like Moana's island in the movie! But if we want to mail the letter, we have to put a stamp on the letter! This fishy stamp is perfect because Moana loves the water so much! Okay, let's put the letter in the mailbox. Moana told her mommy and daddy in the letter that they can send her her birthday gift now. She just has to wait a while for her gift to get here. But when you get back, you can open your special surprise toy. How exciting! Wow, it looks like Moana's surprise gift was just delivered. I wonder what it could be. But wait, I forgot that Dave the Minion is in the mailbox. It looks like he's up to something really silly in there. Oh no! Dave threw out Moana's letter! That's so naughty, Dave! Why would you throw away Moana's letter? <laughs> Dave thinks that this is a fun, silly game. This isn't a good game, but Dave thinks it's so funny. But that wasn't his favorite part. His favorite part is next. Now he's going to take the toy that Moana's mommy and daddy sent to her. There's something in the mailbox already! Is that Moana's toy? It is! Dave, it's already here and you didn't tell Moana! Dave is going to play with the toys all by himself! It looks like a My Little Pony toy! Cool! This is a Twilight Sparkle My Little Pony candy popper! Neat! This is so cool! I love candy poppers, and Twilight Sparkle is so amazing! All of my little ponies are so special! Twilight Sparkle is one of my favorite ponies! She has such pretty and pink purple hair! And she has a big smile on her face! She looks so happy! Let's see how the candy popper works! Maybe it's magic just like her! First, we take off the cap and put the colorful candy in! And this candy is so colorful! 
just like all of the My Little Ponies. After we get the candy in, then we put the cap back on. There! Now, we push the cap down to get the candy. It works! I wonder if Dave wants to try some. Dave, do you want some candy? Here you go! Hmm, I think he likes it. And he especially likes his new Princess Twilight Sparkle candy popper. He's getting back to hide in the mailbox to play with his new toy and steal more toys. And look who's back! Moana is here to see if her mail was delivered. Her gift must be here by now. And she looks so excited. But wait! Moana sees something! Hey! It's Moana's letter! She found it on the ground! How did it get there? Is the mailbox broken? Moana is looking in the mailbox, but she can't find anything. She doesn't even see Dave. Minions are such good hiders. Oh no, she's going to another mailbox instead. Wait Moana, your toy is in there. The minion has it. I hope that doesn't happen to anyone else. Nice, now Maui is here. He wants to mail a letter too. He doesn't know that Dave is taking control of this mailbox. Hopefully he finds out soon and stops this game. Maui has a bright red letter that he wants to mail to Moana. That's so nice! Let's put this green leaf stamp on the letter to mail it. This stamp looks like the grass on the outfit that he wears. Maui wants Moana to send him back a surprise toy. But Maui doesn't know that Dave is going to steal all of the toys. That's not good. And there goes Maui. Now that he left, he may never get a toy back from Moana. Oh, Dave, what do you think you're doing now? More games? And look, he threw another letter out. Now Moana will never get Maui's postcard. And Maui will never get anything back from Moana. Someone needs to stop Dave's game. What did Moana send to Maui? Something Dave took, but what? Let's see what toy Dave got. He's so proud of it and he wants to show us. He wants us to open it for him. It's a Paw Patrol Masham toy. That's so cool. And we got Marshall. Marshall is the red fire pot from Paw Patrol. He drives a fire truck and is very silly like Dave. I bet he would play a joke like this on his friends too. It would make Rocky and Robbo so frustrated. But Marshall is always just trying to have fun, just like Dave. I wonder if Marshall thinks this game is silly, naughty, or fun. Dave loves his new Marshall toy. Marshall is his favorite Paw Patrol pup. Who is your favorite Paw Patrol pup? Let me know in the comments. Maui is already back and he knows something is going on. But he doesn't know Dave is the one behind it. <coughs> he can hear Dave moving around in the mailbox but would never think that someone could be hiding in there. He just found his letter and he's so confused that his letter is on the ground. I think he should inspect the mailbox to see if he can see what is wrong. The mailbox is too dark and he can't see anything. Dave was hiding way in the back with all the toys. Oh, Dave! Now Molly will just have to take his letter somewhere else. Dave finally came out of the mailbox. And look at all the toys he has to play with. Minion just love playing with toys that aren't theirs. Uh-oh! I hear someone else coming. It's Dave's friend Stuart. 
What is he doing here? I think they're going to play their game together. Dave is sharing Moana and Maui's toy with Stuart, and they want more toys. Look how happy the two minions look. And there they go into the mailbox together now. They're going to steal even more toys together. Wait, Moana is back. She wants to see if the mailbox is still broken. This time, Moana has a letter from Maui. She sent Maui the Paw Patrol surprise toy before, but Maui said he never got it. She's going to put it in the mailbox one more time. Don't do it, Moana. Dave and Stuart are in there and are going to steal it again. Hmm, the letter won't fit. That's interesting. Now Moana knows something is wrong with the mailbox. There they are. Moana finally found out what's going on. It's Dave and Stuart who are playing tricks on everyone that uses the mailbox. It's not nice to hide in the mailbox and steal toys. You better give back her toys now. Oh no, the minions know they've been caught and they're running away. Get back here. Moana didn't like it that Dave and Stuart were playing tricks. She thought their joke was too silly. Now she can look in the mailbox and find the missing toys. Yay! It's the My Little Pony toy that her mommy and daddy sent her. And the Paw Patrol toy that she sent to Maui. She's so happy she found them. And Maui will be so happy that he can finally play with his Mashem toy. Wait, what's that? Do I hear minions? Yes! Maui caught Dave and Stuart, and he brought them back. Wow, it's Miguel from Coco. Hi, Miguel. Oh boy, I hope I didn't miss the mailman. I'm really hungry, and I was hoping to get some pizza. I've got my pizza order right here. Doesn't it look so yummy? I can already taste the cheese. Okay, Miguel, go ahead and mail your pizza order. But don't forget to put a stamp on it. Mail always has to have a stamp. Into the mailbox it goes. Your pizza should be here soon. Thanks, Ellie. I'm going to go listen to some music while I'm waiting for it. I'll be right back. And whoa! It looks like the mail is here. Awesome! Now Miguel can come pick it up. Hey! That's not Miguel. That's his dog Dante. And it looks like he has the key to pick up the mail. I know. Maybe he's getting it for Miguel. What a good doggy. Okay, Dante. Just put the key in the mailbox. And you'll find Miguel's pizza surprise inside. <laughs> Yummy. It's a pepperoni pizza. Miguel is going to love it. Let's go find him while the pizza is still hot. Um, Dante, what are you doing? Oh no, Dante is not bringing the pizza back to Miguel. Dante is eating the pizza. No, doggy, that's not good. Now your friend Miguel won't have anything to eat. He ate almost all of Miguel's pizza. And now he's putting it back in the mailbox. Hey, where are you going, Dante? Come back! Nice! The mail is finally here! Now I can pick up my pizza and eat some lunch! Yum! I can already smell it! Hey, wait! Someone already opened my pizza and ate some! I ordered a pizza, but I want a whole pizza! Not a pizza that's already been eaten! I can't eat this. I'll just ask my grandma to make me lunch. But since I'm here at the mailbox, I want to ask something else in the mail. My favorite thing ever. It's even better than pizza. I want a brand new guitar. This time, I already put a stamp on the letter, so it's all ready to go. In it goes. Oh boy, I hope the mailman gets here soon so I can practice some new songs. For now, I'm going to go back to eat some lunch. I'll be back soon. Maybe this time, Miguel can pick up his own mail. But look! 
Uh oh, there's Dante again. What could he be doing this time? Maybe he's really picking up Miguel's mail and giving it to him this time. Give me a big thumbs up if you think Dante's up to another silly plan again. Miguel's guitar is already here. That's great. But wait, Dante's taking the guitar. Dogs can't play guitars, Dante. That's for humans. And it's Miguel's favorite thing ever. He'll be really sad if you take it. I'm so excited to get my guitar. I already know that I'm going to play the song Remember Me as soon as I get it. Oh no, there's no guitar here. Just a bone. I didn't order a bone. Who could be doing this? First, a half-eaten pizza, and now a bone instead of a guitar. Wait, this sounds familiar. I think I know who this is. Someone I know very well. I think I have a plan. Anyway, I want one more thing before the mailbox closes today. I want an LOL doll for my cousin. I already wrote a letter to get my LOL doll in the mail. Now I'll get an LOL doll in no time if I mail this LOL letter. LOL dolls are so cool. And it will be so fun to see which one my cousin gets. I'll be back soon to collect my new doll. Dante already took Miguel's pizza and his guitar. I hope he doesn't take his LOL doll too. But look, there he is again. This doggy sure loves to find surprises in the mailboxes. Oh no, we can't stop him. He's already opening the mailbox again. He has the LOL doll and he's going to bring it back to his doggy house. Only one person can stop him now. Aha! I knew it! It's my silly dog Dante! Dante's favorite trick is opening mailboxes. But that's not nice, Dante. This is my mail, you silly dog. Dante, you're a good dog. But didn't I teach you that it's not nice to open people's mail surprises? First my pizza, then my guitar. Now my LOL doll. Oh boy, I'm going to have to teach this doggy some new tricks. Now, how about we all open this new LOL doll together? See, isn't it nice to be a good doggy? I hope you learned your lesson, Dante. Great idea, Miguel. We have a brand new Wave 2 Confetti Pop surprise just for us. It's always so exciting to open them. But this one's extra special because it's being shared. The first layer will show us our clue, and it says pumping iron. That means this LOL doll is really strong and loves to exercise. We'll surprise what we find under the next layer. I see a tattoo. So cool. It's a pink soccer ball. That must mean that our doll loves to play soccer. Do you know any LOL dolls that like soccer? We have to open some accessory to find out though. Sticker off. Then two more steps. Spin the top and pop the tabs. That's how we get our first accessory. And we got a water bottle. It's neon green with a bright pink lid. What a fun bottle. I hope her other accessories match it. Bing and pop! That's so much fun every time! And what did we get next? It's a sports swimsuit! It's green and white! And it has the number 3 on it! I guess this LOL doll is number 3 on her team! That's so cool! Next up! We have another accessory to find. Pop the tabs and let's see what it is. And here we are, our next accessory. What could it possibly be this time? Ah, it's a pair of sneakers. 
pink and white sneakers. I bet they're perfect for running during recess or in gym class. Or on a soccer field. Now that we found all of our accessories, all we have to do now is find the ribbon to pull and pop. We got it! If we turn the ball upside down, we can pull the ribbon to make it pop. One, two, three, pop! That's why they're called a confetti pop. So much fun! Our doll is around here somewhere. And here she is. But let's open her last accessory first. It's a pink visor. This visor is so cute. It protects her eyes from the sun. And here she is. We got Spike. Yay! Awesome. Spike loves to play sports and her favorite class in school is gym. She likes basketball, volleyball, soccer, and more. Her hair is in pretty pink braids. I wonder what happens when we put her in water. She even likes to swim in the pool. Look, she's a tinkler. What a silly girl. We better get her dried off. Now, who wants to put her clothes on? Let's do it! Wow! You look super cute, Spike! She's ready for a fun day at the beach playing beach volleyball! Just don't forget to drink your water! It's important to take your water bottle! Today was such an awesome day! Sending mails and getting mailbox surprises is so much fun! We got a really amazing LOL doll named Spike! And we even taught Dante a new trick. For more new Coco and LOL videos, you can subscribe to my channel. Now, are you ready for another fun adventure? Let's go!